okay so before we start making the dress i'm going to explain how to make the arm and the arm is quite easy so in the first row you're going to do six single crochets into the magic ring and from the second row until the eighth row we are going to do six single crochets all the way around for a total of six stitches until the end so this is how your little arm should look like so it has a total of eight rows with six single crochets in each row okay so now let's make the dress okay so for the dress we'll start with a uh, chain 12 so we'll do one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven and twelve and then after that we'll uh, take the other end and we'll join like that with a slip stitch to make a small circle like that okay so now uh, we we'll start making the little dress So in the second row, uh, we'll start from uh, where, right where we joined and we'll do single crochet, then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches. Okay, so starting in the, in the uh, stitch where we joined, we'll do single crochet and then increase in the next stitch and then we'll repeat that single crochet and increase and we'll repeat that all the way round okay so now in the third row we we'll start by doing single crochet in the next three stitches so we'll do single crochet one, two, three, and then we'll increase in the next stitch. Okay, and then we'll do single crochet and increase in the next stitch. Then we'll do a single crochet in the next six stitches so we'll do single crochet one two three four five and six okay and then we'll increase in the next stitch And then we'll do single crochet in the next stitch and we'll increase in the next stitch and then we'll do single crochet in the remaining three stitches so single crochet one two and three okay Okay, so now in the fourth round, we'll start by doing uh, three single crochets or single crochet in the next three stitches. So we'll do single crochet one, two, three. Okay, and then uh, we'll do two half double crochet. Okay, so we'll do half double crochet in the next stitch. And then another half double crochet in the next stitch okay and then after that we'll do half double crochet increase so we'll do two half double crochets in the same stitch okay and then we'll do double crochet in the next two stitches so we'll do double crochet 
and double crochet in the next stitch and then we'll do single crochet in the next six stitches so single crochet one two three four five and six and then we'll do double crochet in the next two stitches so double crochet and double crochet in the next stitch okay and then we'll do an increase double crochet in the next stitch so we'll do two double crochet in the same stitch okay and then we'll do double crochet in the next two stitches so double crochet and double crochet in the next stitch and then in the last three stitches we'll do single crochets okay so now we have a total of 24 stitches okay so now in round five we are going to do single crochet in the next three stitches <coughs> So we'll do single crochet one, two, three, okay, and then we'll do chain six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So this is for the little arm, and then we'll skip six stitches. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and then here in the seventh stitch. We'll do single crochet and we'll do single crochet in the next five stitches. So one, two, three, four, five. And then again do chain six. One, two, three, four five six then skip six stitches one two three four five six and then in the seventh stitch we'll do single crochet and the remaining two stitches okay so now we have a total of 24 stitches Okay, so now after that, uh, in the next two rows, which is row six and row seven, we're going to do single crochets all the way around for a total of 24 stitches in each row. Okay, so I'll see you when you're done with the seventh row so that we do the eighth row together. Okay, so sorry I forgot to tell you. So when you get to where we did the chains also, you're going to do single crochets in the little chains over here like that. Okay, and you continue making single crochets all the way around. Okay, so I'll see you when you're done with the next round, which is the seventh round, so that we do the eighth round together. Okay, so after we're done with our seventh row, this is how our dress should look like, our little arms over here. Okay, so now in our eighth row, we are going to do a double crochet increase in each stitch for a total of 48 stitches. Okay, so this is the lower part of the dress. So we're going to do two double crochets in each stitch. Okay, so double crochet and in the same stitch do another double crochet. Okay, so also do a double crochet increase in the next stitch. Okay, so double crochet increase. Okay, and you continue doing double crochet increases all the way 
round okay so after our eighth row this is how it looks like our double crochet increases so now in our ninth row we are going to do double crochet in each stitch all the way around for a total of 48 um, double crochets okay so we'll do double crochet in the next stitch then double crochet and then we'll continue doing double crochet all the way okay so do double crochet all the way until the end after that now in our 10th row which is the last row of the dress uh, we are going to do a chain three so one two three and then we are going to slip stitch into the next stitch so slip stitch okay and then we repeat that so chain three and then slip stitch into the next stitch chain three slip stitch into the next stitch okay and we'll keep repeating that all the way round okay so after we're done this is how the little dress looks like so we're going to slip stitch and then cut off the yarn okay and then i'm going to do the finishing so I just pull my yarns together that I just cut like that and do a little tie and cut it off. Okay, so this is how a little dress looks like. So uh, to put it on, we are going first to sew the arms here and then we are going to put the little dress like that and then pull the arms through here. Okay, so now we are going to make the hair. Okay, so the hair is quite easy. So we are going to start with the bangs or the front hair and we are going to do a chain seven. So one, two, three four five six and seven okay and then after that starting in the second uh, chain from the hook we are going to do six single crochets so we'll do single crochet one two three four five and six okay and then again we're going to do a chain seven so one two three four five six seven and then same as this starting from the second chain from the hook we're going to do six single crochets Okay, so this is how it looks. Okay, so you're going to continue like that until you have one, two, three, four, five, six. Six of this like that. Okay, so this is going to be the bang. Okay, and then for the back hair, as you can see, I made it the same way. But for the back hair, I did a chain 20. And then after I did a chain 20, starting from the second chain from the hook, I did 19 single crochets. 
and then I repeated the same process as this chain I did a chain 20 again 19 single crochets all the way until you have 12 12 of these okay so these are 12 for the back hair and these are six for the front hair okay so and then after that I'll show you how to join all the parts together Okay, so guys as you can see I've already finished attaching all the parts together so uh, for the hair what I did is I attached the long part first over here then I folded a little hair and crocheted it I mean and then uh, sold it uh, here at the back as you can see so this is how it looks like so as you can see I didn't completely uh, seal it off and um, I'm gonna do that with some glue later Okay, and then uh, the front part uh, which are the bangs. I attach them right where um, Right together with the back part of the hair as you can see so this is how I looked and then over here at the front I used some glue and then attached uh, the bangs over there Okay, and then uh, for the eyes also I embroidered them but if you have the doll eyes you can use them too and then I made the little bow over here and then I uh, remember I told you to sew the arms first uh, before uh, we put up before attaching the head so you sew the hands right below the neck as you can see so this is the neck and then the hands are right below it and then put on the uh, the dress and then uh, uh, sew the head uh, together with the neck as you can see also you can put some little wire over here for the neck so that uh, the neck is stable as you can see okay so that's it for today guys I hope you enjoyed this pattern if you have any questions you can ask in the comments below and also you can check out my other videos and until next time bye